Think of the most compelling, most dynamic, most flat-out amazing presentation you've ever seen, delivered by someone you consider to be the smartest and most skilled in her field. Think about how that speaker responded to the handful of questions asked during Q&A. She was unflappable. She answered them all with grace and ease. Or perhaps no questions were asked because the presentation was just that good. Did you know that speaker was just one good question away from being stumped? It probably never occurred to you because presenting is a performance. And when we see a performance done well, we tend to assume only the very best about the performer. But no one knows the answer to every question, no matter how educated they are. Just imagine a presentation given by someone magically imbued with all the knowledge of the universe, a person who actually knows the answer to every question that could ever be asked. A person stands up in the back of the auditorium and asks the omnipotent speaker, what's a question that you can ask an all-knowing speaker that they can't answer? Boom, stumped. Why am I telling you this? Because if you've been asked to present something, then you're probably familiar with the question that often plagues the minds of those brave enough to give presentations, which is, what if they ask me a question I can't answer? The answer is to learn three words. Listen carefully to these. You should learn them well. You should practice saying them until you can deliver them with unshakable confidence. I don't know. It's okay not to have the answer to every question. And it's far better to admit it with confidence than to stammer or look down at the floor defeated. You can always write the question down and promise to email the answer to the audience later. Or you can turn the question around and ask the audience, what do they think the answer is? Just remember, when we see a performance done well, we assume the best about the performer. If you've practiced your presentation and delivered it well, the audience won't crucify you simply because you couldn't answer a particular question. Good luck on your next presentation. Stay happy, my friends.